Hello friends, in this video we will discuss what you need to know before heading to your permanent makeup appointment, what can be done to achieve the best results, and what cases you need to consider to change the pain new technician. My name is Anna Malenkina and I am the owner of a chain of lash and brow salons in Las Vegas. Also, guys, I'm the business uh, trainer for the beauty industry. Now, guys, with many years of experience as a permanent makeup artist, I have extensive knowledge about this procedure. And today I'm gonna share it with you. Friends, subscribe to my channel, like it and comment on this video, and follow my Instagram page for more useful tips and tricks. If you dream of getting permanent eyebrow or lip makeup, but have been hesitant so far, I will share everything you need to know to ensure you will receive the highest quality procedure and remain satisfied for many years. Here is the seven, seven essential steps you need to follow to achieve the best results. Okay, let's start with the first one. If you have already chosen the technician who will perform this procedure, either you found a uh, technician through social media or um, a recommendation from someone you know, first thing you need to do, you need to schedule a consultation, which is usually free with the most specialist. Some specialists might change, charge a small fee, which might later be included in the service cost. If a specialist suggests you scheduling the procedure right away without the consultation or ask no question about your health condition and any country education, you should still clear from the specialist. Second, during the consultation, you should ask technician to show uh, you some videos of their work. Yes, videos. Guys, nowadays many technicians use retouching on their photo to attract client and present their work um, favorably, right? Videos are generally more authentic. Uh, ensure that the video do not use any filters and image should be very clear. If you see blurness in the video, that indicates they use some filters. Step number three, pay attention to the room where the procedure will take a place. It should be clean and you should also check uh, for the presence of all necessary licenses. In addition to have a permission to perform permanent makeup, the specialist must also undergo um, annual, some annual trainings in handling blood and other uh, body fluids. The certification is called Bloodborne Pathogen Certification. Be aware that in most US states, providing permanent makeup services without license or inappropriate place such as home, it's considered as a crime. One of the most important steps is the creation of the sketch of your future eyebrows or lips by the technician. Then they must to show it to you, the sketch, for your approval. And only after your approval, they can proceed with a permanent application on your skin. Guys, otherwise you at risk ending up with a surprise on your lips or eyebrows. And the final steps is checking the sketch drawn by your technician only in a vertical position. Checking the sketch horizontally will never show you whether your lips or eyebrows are symmetric. Okay guys, I hope that with my advice you will achieve excellent results. Good luck with your permanent makeup procedure. Please follow my Instagram page for more tips and tricks in the beauty business. Don't forget to subscribe and like this video. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comment section below.